Now on Anglia, meet the men and women whose business is danger in the World Stunt Championships. Uh, but the stunts which are shown in these programs are carried out by trained professionals and, of course, should not be attempted by anybody else. <laughs> for women. Um, I, I mean, I, I, I believe women can do just as good as men. Um, and I wish there was more. There were more, definitely. Really. Now, you've been seen a lot on the television. People know you quite well now. They're always asking you to push it a little bit farther, aren't they? Well, yes. I mean, I, I'm game. You know, if the right, um, obviously the right stunt came up and the um, then yes, I'd have a go. I wouldn't uh, not try. <laughs> How true was it that they tried to get you to do this topless? <laughs> Very true. <laughs> well, I again, I mean, you know, being a woman, they think, oh well, this is what she's got. You know, I don't need to lose my top. I don't. I, I mean, I don't want to. I mean, I do a job as good as the men, and I don't need to lose my top. I mean, <laughs> that's quite. So you refused. <laughs> Most definitely, yes. <laughs> There's no trickery involved, it doesn't have any zippers, and you will see in a moment that it fits Gail very, very tightly. How did you get into the business in the first place? Accident? Design? Well, a bit of both, really. I used to work for an escapologist, and he fell from 80 foot doing the same stunt as I'm doing today, and it was a great opportunity for a girl to do a man's job um, and after about six months nine months training there I was upside down with my burning rope what hurts um, my ankles <laughs> that's what um, causes discomfort with the straps um, around my ankles the more you move the tighter they get and if they're placed on awkwardly then it's quite um, quite painful What effect does being upside down all that time have on you? Well, for one thing, the blood rushes to your head anyway. It's exhausting getting out, working up there upside. It's quite a different sort of thing than being stood up anyway. It gives you a very he heavy sort of head, and after a while, you really can't see. When I get down for about nearly a minute, it's all sort of blur and full hazy. Oh, oh! 